Well, they're preparing to go to court with landowners who refuse to let them on their property, but that's not stopping Dominion from moving forward with a controversial plan to build the Atlantic Coast Pipeline, and they want to hear from you. They're back in Hampton Roads today hosting their second round of open houses. I talked to them about the battle that's been brewing before construction even begins. If approved, the Atlantic Coast Pipeline would go into service in 2018, but some people in Virginia and North Carolina aren't going to make that process a smooth one for Dominion Virginia Power. Dominion has filed legal notices against about 120 landowners along the pipeline route at this time. Uh, these landowners have steadfastly refused to give us permission to survey. Many more notices are on the way, including four in Suffolk and four more in Chesapeake. This is a plan that has had controversy from the start. They just don't want the pipeline on their property. They don't want it on their property. Some counties don't want it in their county. Since their last round of open house forums in the fall, Dominion has been swiftly working on a 300-foot study corridor to see what will work along the route and what won't. In some cases, the pipeline might run right down the middle of their property. We certainly don't want to do that. that get, that's why we have the flexibility of the 300-foot study corridor. Dominion claims its goal is to create the best route with the least impact to the environment and historical and cultural resources as possible, and they can't do that without you. We have made some route changes, really hundreds and hundreds of route changes since the last uh, open house. That's based on a lot of important feedback from landowners. They're planning to file their preferred route with the Federal Energy Regulatory Commission this summer, even if they have a few court dates with those opposed to their work along the way. Tonight's open house begins in just about 30 minutes at the Jolliffe Middle School Cafeteria in Chesapeake. It'll last from 5 to 730.